we got a 1937 Ford. You can see it's lowered. It's got you know, an aftermarket rack and pinion steering in there, right down there. Still got the running boards on it, running lights. Uh, headers, you know, aftermarket engine chrome. Uh, alternator, of course, no generator. You can see the steering comes in there like that, manual steering. Probably steers pretty quick. And we got some nice comfortable seats in here, a lot of room in the interior. Automatic transmission with the indicator right there. Nice aftermarket gauges. And your window pops out. You see that right there? Right there, right? Window pops out. Got a nice pinstripe on the side. Look at that puppy, man. Ready to rock and roll. Little baby moons on it, the chrome rings. Big exhaust tips. You know what's cool about this? It's like it's a car you could drive because uh, you know it's not you know it's got the fenders on it and you can still got your running boards, but it's like it's it's got all the aftermarket stuff. It's lowered and stuff. It'll cruise really nice down the highway and stuff. In other words, with uh, you know the handling, the power, reliability, and you got the louvers in the hood and. Um, you know, the sides of the hoods are off, so you got plenty of cooling power. That, I think, would be, with that size engine in there, I think not doing that. If you're in stop-and-go traffic, you might be percolating the fuel, getting a little uh, vapor lock, but I guess that's probably eliminated with that setup. But if you, if you run a return fuel line, um, that usually eliminates all your vapor lock. So... Get your wiring coming out. <laughs> Did all that, you know, I mean, I guess you put a little wire, a little cover over that wire and stuff, but uh, I guess, you know, it's okay like that too. Electric, electric choke. See that puppy right here? Electric choke. You got your quick uh, turn off things for the uh, valve covers. You want to adjust them. Little PCB valve and stuff. Starter motors right down here. All right, you see it's a gold thing. Got a nice braided steel hose coming off the mechanical fuel pump, and you got air conditioning. Look at that air. Is there? Hey, you notice that air conditioning right there? Put your electric fans. So I guess that's one of the reasons he looks cool though with it open like that. It's old school, but it's got you know with that visor and the window popping open like that and the air conditioning, man. It's, Really cruise with this puppy.